Yeah, so these are obviously what the old houses look like. You can actually own these houses, but they don't look the same inside anymore. So obviously this is what a typical house would have looked like. A very posh house though. That's um, Frodium Vicarage, so that's what it would have looked like. But then if you come around here, you see it's like the older houses. <laughs> oh. Stairs upstairs. I don't know if it opens, I don't think it does. No, it don't open. No. But yes, this would be what your house would roughly look like. Why not? Why not cook some food for dinner? Okay. Might need help. The pans are heavy. You don't have a bit of weight to them. Doesn't feel the most practical. You're gonna get a bit rusty in that. Yeah, just a bit over the years. No, it's name their bellows over there. Try and use squeeze them bellows. Oh, it's not actually as bad as it would have been probably back in the day. No, I think they would have been nice and loose anyway. I found a cooking kit. Teapot bits. A coffee tray. I think oh, so. a pan tray. Well, I don't know if there's anything in the other drawers. Probably not totally the other drawers, I guess. No, it's not. Oh. Plates. Hang on a minute, wait a second. Witherspoon's plate there. That's where they've got their plates from. Oh, that is a Witherspoon. <laughs> Through the little pantry bit. Good <laughs> Osters. So we're starting to get into World War One, but we're still in the local history section. But as you move around, there's actually this gun plot going for miles around here, or what did you say that meant? Right at the bottom then? Oh, uh, one sec, let me just. I'll get you the proper translation rather than just a rough okay. one. So one code. So down there is the Scunthorpe coat of arms and it translates to the heavens reflect our labours. Reflect our labours, there you go. Is that all supposed to be in that position? Pass. Well, it looks a little bit uh, wrong to me. It's getting spanked with a boot. Yeah. Anderson Shelter. Yeah, that block of cheese over there that's rationed. I used to eat, and I could eat that all to myself in a day. Air raid siren. So, this is natural air raid siren. Could you imagine that? Sitting listening to that. Oh, it makes me head stop. That's itch like hell. Oh my god. Itchy, oh, itchy blanket. Yeah. It's quite cosy in here though. Is it? Yeah. You'd be breathing on each other for hours. Could you imagine a whole family in here? You'd probably have 12 people in here. Has she? Yeah. I bet it's worth some pennies then, maybe. I don't know. If she's still got it in her kitchen. That'd be nice. Not like a hero stairs, I really like your dress. Look better or worse, ER? Oh, that's better. Much better. Oh, yes. 
But your granddad's got one, eh? I've never seen it. But, it's, you, but your dad's got one, eh? Sorry. The remains of a longboat. Yeah, found on the bed of the old river. Uh, I don't know, is that right? Axon? Anchor. Anchor? It's Axon. It's it is Axon, that's what I'm talking about. 1943. Anchor. The Anchor. brig boat. Anchor. But it's finally brigged then. April 1886. That's quite impressive. Skeleton as we came in, that's what they reckon she looked like. Have a mosaic up here. The largest explosion in the UK since the Second World War. 28 people died and many were injured. Yeah, like a mushroom ball, though, like it says, isn't it? It happened first thing in the morning when the shift changed in the walls, so we had many people. Mm -hmm. I wonder if it does renders because it was renders at all, bro. It's a bird, wasn't it? The explosion. This pushed the Health and Safety Act along in 1974 that we use today. The bill was passed because of this. Well, there's going to be a push through anyway, but made it more of a priority.